Hello guys, this is Sharon here from 24-7 Techie and in this video I am going to show you guys how to get rid of the heating issues on the OnePlus 2. So a lot of people have uh, complained that they are facing heating issues on the top of the phone so this part does get a little warm compared to uh, any other part of the phone and uh, in this video I am going to tell you how to get rid of the heating issues. So my phone is right now running on the AK kernel so I will be leaving a link in the description where there will be a written instructions how to install the AK kernel on the uh, OnePlus 2 so as you can see it is the AK kernel and it is one of the most stable kernels for the OnePlus 2 or any any phone uh, in practical so after flashing the AK kernels you just need to download a, uh, a single uh, file from the uh, Google Play Store that is the kernel auditor and uh, this is the kernel auditor that you will you will get and to fix the heating issues we, uh, we just need to do a, go into the CPU and as you can see I have, uh, we can alter the CPU frequencies on this so we can set the maximum frequency at 1.2 gigahertz and put the CPU governor at uh, interactive so through this it will be like uh, what all it needs so if I put it on performance and if it's uh, clocked at 1.2 gigahertz you can see it is uh, showing that it's 1.2 gigahertz so if you put it on 1.2 gigahertz I have noticed that there's no issues with the day-to-day uh, -day performance of the phone so this is the big cores the uh, the four the quad cores that uh, that are clocked at 1.8 gigahertz and these are the cores that are clocked at 1.6 gigahertz so in this uh, we will set uh, we'll set the maximum frequency at uh, 1.2 gigahertz same as uh, same as above so both the both the cores are clocked at 1.2 gigahertz so i've noticed that there is no issue in the day to day performance of the phone yes while gaming in the, notice a little bit of a slow uh, slow gameplay or a little bit of lag so for that uh, you just need to do is uh, clock it back at, back at 1.7 gigahertz just edit the big uh, big cores and it will work perfectly fine and uh, the heating issues for, for the day to day performance will be fixed easily so i've noticed that uh, after putting the phone on 1.2 gigahertz there is not at all heating on this phone and it is running very smoothly now so uh, i will show you another thing um, so as we as you can see i've clocked uh, clocked both the cpu cores at uh, 1.2 gigahertz and when we go into cpu z you can see it clearly that it's uh, all uh, all the cores are running on 1.2 gigahertz so none of them is going over overclocked so if you, I will show you if it's really working or not. So I will put the bigger at 1.7 and the small at 1.6, and uh, you can see it easily it's, uh, that four cores are working at 1.6 and four cores are working on 1.8. So this is working very fine, and um, this is in proof that uh, everything is working very nicely. So thank you guys for watching this video. This was Sean here from 24/7 Techie, showing you guys the easiest way to get rid of the heating issues on the OnePlus 2. Everything on the phone is working fine. So the fingerprint sensor and everything is working fine. So there's no issues with the kernel, and uh, you must give it a try. If you guys have any issues or video requests or anything you would like to have a talk with me, do contact me on Facebook, Twitter, or even comment on the video, and I will surely get in touch with you and guys please do subscribe to our channel because we really need subscribers and uh, your click on the red subscription button can be a very big help to us and i really hope to see you in my next video till then see ya